Do you believe it has personhood? How, how can you play yeah. that something from an angel yeah. is the Holy Spirit when it's only a God? Because firstly, you're, 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 I'll explain giving, to you. you're giving the angels the equivalent of God. Okay, I'll explain it to you. Firstly, in the Quran, when the word the Holy Spirit is used, when the uh, terminology Ruh al Quddus is used, it, yeah, it's the Ruh al Quddus. So when it talks about the angel Jibreel, yeah. yeah. Exactly. So exactly. So what? Yeah. Can, you have to let us finish. You have to let us finish. My friend. My friend. You have to let us finish. Yeah. So when we are talking about in the Quranic terminology, Allah has described the angels with the word spirit. But when we're talking about Christianity, if you're going to put an attribute of God to the Holy Spirit, now that's where the problem lies about. Because why? Let me tell you why. Look. Let me tell you why. You believe in the personhood of a Holy Spirit. You believe the Holy Spirit is God. You also believe Jesus is God. You also believe the Father is God. But you, no, no, it doesn't matter. That's the foundation. You cannot believe, you cannot claim to be a person to believe in one God. We believe in one God. So you're saying the angels are equivalent to God? No, absolutely not. Because why the angels, you are saying that. Wait one second. How can you describe them as God? So do you believe Do you believe Gabriel has the attribute of God? No. Okay, cool. So Gabriel is an angel, right? Okay, now the Holy Spirit. Is the Holy Spirit God or is the Holy Spirit an angel? The Holy Spirit is part of God. Okay, cool. Okay, Why didn't Gabriel say it is easy for me? Gabriel said it is easy for him, for yeah. God. Exactly. If Gabriel was God, he would have said it was easy for me. It's not for God. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, but, no, no, but no, 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 I think he's, he's saying something else. He's saying, he is basically saying, you just walked away. He's going to walk away. You run away. You're just going to run away. You believe in three gods. We believe in one God. We don't believe angels are gods. We believe an angel is a person that gives a relation. But why do you worship Jesus? Why do you worship the Holy Spirit? Why do you worship the Holy Spirit? You guys are polytheists. You guys are polytheists. Let's be real now. We as Muslims, we believe in one God. We believe in the messengers. But you lot worship. You lot worship, unfortunately, babies. You're now saying that the angels... Okay. Do Muslims worship babies? Do Muslims worship babies? I have no idea. Do Christians worship babies? Worship babies? Yeah, of course. Jesus was a baby, right? They don't worship no, but babies. Was Jesus, they, they, but was Jesus as a baby? Was he God as well? So were you, and the disciples, were they worshipping the baby? No, no, answer the question. Is he not, he's not answering the question now. You're not answering the question. No, but do you, do you believe worshipping babies? Us Muslims, we don't believe worshipping angels. Us Muslims, we worship one Allah. No, we don't associate any worship of, no. That's, for example, Jesus is also has special terminology in our books as well. He has a kalam, he has a speech of Allah. The, the, the word of Allah, sorry, the word of Allah. So, because he was created, he's created by Allah's word. So, Jesus has praiseworthy things as well. But, thing is, when you guys, I'm saying that in the Quran, of course, listen to me very carefully. Let me tell you about Jesus. Jesus in the Quran, he was an individual that Allah has made. Kun fa yakun, be an and it is. And he was created without a, uh, Mary having a husband, okay? So, we believe in this. But you guys believe that just because Jesus had a miraculous birth, apparently he's God. Adam is better than him. Adam had no mother and father. The Quran came hundreds of years after. Wait, what do you mean? So what about the New Testament came after the after the Old Testament as well, though, didn't it? It did come after Jesus. No, but it came after the Old Testament, didn't it? That's what I'm trying to say to you. So that the Quran is the final book of God. I'm saying to you, listen, don't believe in idol worship. Come on, my friend. Let's be real. It doesn't make sense. No, but it doesn't make sense calling upon Jesus now. Come on, does it? Let's be real. He's a human being. Let's be real. Come on. Be humble. Understand it. Jesus is a human being. He eats food. He defecates. How can you worship him? It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense to be honest with you, man. Yeah, cool. Nah, nothing, nothing, nothing. Just not cool. My name is Osama. What's your name?